Hi, I am Ravi and in this particular video, we will try to solve a question on Venn diagram with 4 sets. In this particular question, I am given that in a college there are 4 newspapers, Economic Times, Business Standard, Business Line and Financial Express. They are read by a category of students, a variety of students and then you have a few questions which are based on it. So to first of all, we need to figure out how to draw a Venn diagram for 4 sets. For that, what you can do is draw something like this. First of all, you should try and draw a rectangle or a square like this. Then this essentially what I have drawn, this will comprise of one set. This will comprise of another set. Another set here and another set here. So let me just note down the sets, say economic times, I am going to represent economic times here. So ET is this particular portion, these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. These 8 portions are going to represent economic times. Business standard, let's say this is business standard. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 will represent business standard. This is business line, very similarly 8 for business line. And finally, the bottom 8 will be for financial express. Now, let us look at the data and how we can fill that data in. We are given 4 given which are in the order. We will have 230, 180, 180 and 220 students which means ET total is going to be 220, BS total is going to be 180, business line total is also going to be 180 and financial express total is all going to be 220. Now, the number of students reading exactly two newspapers, okay, is for any two is 20. So, which one is exactly two? This portion is exactly 2 because which 2? Business standard and ET. This one is exactly 2 uh, business line and business standard. This one is exactly 2 financial express. It falls under financial express. It falls under business standard. This is also exactly 2 and this is also exactly 2. This one is ET and business line. This one here is financial express and economic time. Then we are given 30 students who read all 4. So this is 30. Uh, nobody who reads exactly 3. So these 4 which were left out, these were exactly 3 which come to be 0. Now we need to look at how many individuals are there. So 20, 20 and 20, 60 and 30, 90 is gone. 90 is gone out of 220 which means 130 remains here. Again 90 is gone out of 180. So 90 is left here. Okay, this portion was also 20 because it was read by business line and financial express. Now 90 is gone from this also. So 90 is left here. And again 90 is gone from financial express also. So how many are left? 130 are left here out of 220. Oh, I'm sorry, I made a mistake. ET was not 220. ET was 230 which makes it 140 here. Okay. Now let's look at the questions. How many students read exactly two newspapers? Okay. So for exactly two newspapers it was 20 and how many times it was coming? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 which means my answer will be 20 into 6 or 120 for the first one. Second question says, how many read exactly one? Only ET was 140. Only BS was 90. Only business line was 90. And only financial express was 130, which makes it how much? 90 and 90 is 180. 180 and 140, 180 and 140 will be 320. 320 and 130. So this comes out as 450 is my answer for the second one. Let's look at the third one now. How many students do not read any newspaper at all? For that, we were given this particular information here. 
that 20% of them do not read any business newspaper. That means 80% of them read some sort of newspaper or the other. Now to look at which ones are these, we can take 230 first of all for ET. So you have 230 for ET which will cover this particular portion. How many extra are there? Then this line has 90, 20 and 20 which makes it how much? 90 and 20 is 110, 110 and 20 is 130 and then we have this particular set. 130 and 20 is 150, 150 and 90 is 240. So I got 230, 130 and 240 which gives me a total of 600. This 600 represents 80% of the lot. What do we need to find out? We need to find out 20% who do not read anything. So if 80% is 600, 20% would be how much? 20% would be 20% would be 150. I made a mistake. So 20% of 600 will be 150. Which is my answer for the third one. Fourth and final. What percentage of people reading business standard also read at least one other newspaper? Okay. So business standard. Only business standard is 90. What is left? 20, 20, 30 30 and 20. So other than more than one is 90 out of a total of 150 which gives me the answer as 50 percent so the answers that i was looking for for the first one was 120 for the second is 450 for the third is 150 and for the fourth is 50 percent with this i would like to wrap up this session please provide feedback via twitter at my twitter handle at the rate ravi handa thank you